What's going on everyone? Thanks for tuning in. Let's jump back in time. 2020, I think, is the is the year with Jumpstart when it first came out. And we're gonna do two boxes. And when you think Jumpstart, think CPR. That's really the cards of value. Crater Hoof, Phyrexian Tower, and Ristic Study. If you pull any one of those three cards, at the moment, you're half the value of the whole box. So we're gonna try to pull uh, multiple CPRs today. I guess you could say Allosaurus, uh, Shepherd's, you know, another big one. But you know, CPR is really the the main three that we want to hit in this set. So we're gonna go through two boxes, um, relive the past. And for those of you who may be new to Magic: The Gathering and you know weren't in there in 2020 buying some packs, um, it, this was really a unique idea where you could open two packs, shuffle them, and you have a deck already. You don't have to worry about making it. You know. Uh, crafting from sealed it's already pre-made for you it really makes things easy and I've done a lot of jumpstart you know games myself so kind of shows you shows you the rules this box is super cheap right now uh, I think like $72 or something like that I, I think you can even get it cheaper on eBay at the moment um, so we're gonna go through and um, you know we're gonna hit big and Oh, I forgot that they're they're individually sealed inside the boosters. This is the devilish. Okay, so Sheldred could be in here. Sheldred, um, good old Sheldred. Um, but this whole pack of cards is, you know, the themes of devils, right? Oh, no, they're red ones. Sorry. Um, Traitorous Greed, Dance, Havoc, Pitchburn, Forge, and then you got your lands. So it already comes pre-lands in there, so you don't need to worry about those. Um, obviously, you know, nothing nothing crazy in that pack. What do we got here? Spirits. Okay. And the the uh, 2022 didn't have that wrapping. Shacklegeist. Okay. What do we got here? Is this the one Ristic Studies in? I don't think so. Capture Sphere. Thriving. And then some of the islands. Okay. Like I said, we're going to hit big. We're not going to... Another spirits. Sometimes they're different, though. Sometimes they're different, so we'll see. Shackle guys. <laughs> okay. 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 That was, uh... You know, not great to see. I've never opened a Jumpstart product on the channel, so I'm, uh, I feel like it's a little bit blasphemy to open it and not play with it. I think there might be an angel in this one. Is there an angels? There's a couple of angels worth like 10 or 15 bucks. What do we got? Steel Plume Marshall. Okay. Even. Onslaught. Blue. Pegasus. Healer. I don't know. Are you guys offended? I'm opening this and not playing. I'm opening to pull for the value. Or say... Yeah, there we go. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, here he is. Here he is Unleashed 2021. Oh, does that mean we can pull Terror of the Peaks in here? I think we can, actually. CPR plus the Peaks, if we're lucky. Um, I, think, I think it's possible, now that you mention it. Yep, it is possible. Harbinger. I was thinking about. It. I was like, why do I remember Terror of the Peaks being a possible pull in this? And that's why it was right done right at the time of uh, 2021. Okay. Well, red. That means you can pull the big T man, the big T of the peaks, to fairy. You can pull. Peaks, well read. Ristic study, and there it is. That's how this is done. Half the box is already paid for in one card. There it is. That's how you do it. Well read. That's what you want to see. So we open them, we see well read, and there you go. Ristic study. Talarian, Curiosity, system, oh, Bookcase, Opt, Visionary. Okay. Wow, 
We got one of the CPRs already. Above the clouds. Uh-oh. What's coming in here? Gale Force. Unsubstantiate. Okay. Nothing too crazy there. What do we got? Goblins. Oh, we got the big goblin guy in here. He's worth like 13 bucks or so. Maxis. Maxis is in here, I believe. Goblin Chieftain. I guess. What, 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 what? Goblin Goon? Goblin Chieftain? I thought Maxis was in this. It's been so long since I've done this, so. I could be wrong, could be wrong. Ideally, you want to pull one or two of these, pay back the box and two cards, sell it instantly, and then everything else, all the rest of the inventory you're holding would be profit when it sells, right? So it doesn't need to sell immediately. Um, so for me to turn the capital, I just want to see, you know, two of those cards so I can sell them off quick. Pirates, Corsair Captain, Charter Course, Spectral Sailor, Read the tides. Doctors. It's a life gain deck. Life gain? Uh oh, moment of heroism. Where's the rare? Speaker! Speaker of the heavens. There he is. That's a couple bucks. Wonder why that was first. That was weird. God. Plus ones. Odd. I'm, I'm probably not opening these inner inner packs, right? But whatever. Whatever. Branching evolution. I don't know what this is doing, to be honest. Champion. I, I, I just I don't actually don't know those. Scourge, gift, ness. Okay. Minions, Shouldred's probably in here. Maybe, maybe the um, Cauldron Cat. A uh, cat. Uh, it could also be Phyrexian Tower. Could be here. There could be a lot of good things. Okay, Ghoul Caller. Yeah, Cauldron, Eliminate, Gormund, Liliana's Imp, Accomplice, Village Rights. Yeah. Okay. What am I, what am I doing here? Oh, what the heck was I doing? Okay. Ghoul Caller. Yeah. She was just in Commander Masters, right? We just saw her. Devilish? Did we get another Devilish again? Same one? Really? Taunter. Hmm, goblins. Weird. Maybe the rare kind of changes things up. Pitch Burn, Act of Treason, Lightning Core. Yeah, odd. Yeah, this is fun stuff. So like, you know, you buy a box of this, have it sitting around, you have some folks over, and you know, you can burn through this, so it's gonna take a while. Unless you're doing what I'm doing. Dogs. Pack leader, okay. Hound of Conda. Okay. Watchdog. Trusty Mutt. Wonder if this is a Valuable thing with that big commander deck going on. All that stuff. Hoopla. All that rigmarole. There we go. Double vision. Nothing crazy there. Chandra, lightning. Immolator, shock. Is there a lightning in here? No, there's not. CPR. I kind of want a Phyrexian Tower. Just like for myself. I pulled one before, I sold it. Heavily armored. Cathar's Crusade. That's actually a pretty good one. A couple bucks. Um, Patron. Feet. Lightwalker. Acolyte. So this kind of gives you an idea what's in here. Gollum, maybe this one has Maxis. Maxis the Thraxis in here. It is Maxis, right? Goblin Chieftain, Goblin Goon again. Where the heck's Maxis? 
Can we get what duplicate of the Ristic Study one? Well read. It's the duplicate there. Come on. There we go. Rogues. Children? Oh, Thieves Guild. Okay. That one. Broker. Okay. I am putting, I think, prices up on the screen on this one. It's a little bit harder. I'm only going to probably do rares. Uh, rares and above. Rares and mythics. I'm not probably going to do anything with uh, uncommons. Okay. The glass spinner. I think that one's actually something. Rookie walls. Lofty denial. Going for big, big hits here. It's a fairy. Okay. Big T Man might. I think he's going to be in here. Planeswalker 2021. Master of Time. Is the old Master of Time going to be in here? That's a $10, $9 card. There he is. Boom. Master of Time. That's what we like to see. All right. Ageless Insight. That's another decent one. Okay. At least it is foil. I'm not sure. I'm not sure the non foil. Oh, we got a. <laughs> We got a showcase uh, island there. Give us a peaks. I want the peaks. Vampires. This one's definitely got cauldron crowns. Um, this one might have exsanguinate. Or I'm sorry, exquisite blood. Exquisite blood could be in here. Veto. Okay. Veto's a couple bucks. Blood artist. A couple bucks. Well, 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 well. Exquisite blood is in here. I know it is. We'll find it. Cathar's Crusade again. That's a another you know ten thirteen dollar card. So, Siege Striker. Hope you guys don't mind me moving so fast on this. Um, you know, my assumption is you may have seen some of these cards before, and you know you're hunting them with me. Reanimated. Okay, reanimated. Cauldron, Phyrexian Tower. Come on, sacrifice a creature. You know. Gain two black. Two swamp. What in the world? Okay, we need a surgical procedure here. There we go. There we go. Okay, Phyrexian Tower. I want a Cauldron Crone too. Boom, Grave Walker. No, that's not what I want to see. Scourge of the Nell Toth. Okay. Zombie, Gormand, Eliminate, Quick Wipe, Arise Again. Oh. That's not what I wanted to see at all. Why is Cauldron Crone not in there? Cauldron Cat. Whatever that word is. Why is that not there? Wizards. What's in the Wizards one? You guys remember? Boom! Laboratory. Return a wizard you control to its owner's hand. Okay. Interesting. Talran. I feel like that's good for all you wizard deckers. Read the tides. Okay. Well, we are one box down, and uh, we have one to go. I bought three because I'm actually going to keep one and hang on to it. This price is just too low, and the cards in here are pretty decent. They can't reprint them all. Right? They can't reprint them all. So, I, I mean, with certain stuff like this that's this old and the price is this good, I mean, the new stuff, I know, you know, Rudy will say, yeah, stock up on the, on the sealed stuff, but to me, if something's already aged, you know, for almost four years, like, why would you not buy that over some of the new stuff? Because, you know, <laughs> it's already been aged, right? So, to me, if I'm storing stuff, it's going to already be a little older. Predatory, and plus, some of the singles on the older stuff don't turn as fast with velocity as the newer stuff do. So, because of that, it, sometimes it makes sense to hold the old stuff and not the new stuff. Predatory, Crater Hoof. Come on, give me a Crater Hoof here. Fall, <sighs> Bailiff. 
That first box, though, let's, let me actually stop for a second, and, uh, I'm gonna start a second pile. You figure, we're, what, almost 40 here, 30, uh, 26 here, 10 here, so that's 36, 40, 76. So right here in these four cards, it paid for that first box. Then, you know, you figure a couple bonus cards over here, veto and stuff like that, and then everything in this stack is profit. Even if I don't put it up on the screen. So I want you guys to understand that. I'm, I might not put things up on the screen that are 50 cents, a dollar, but I sell all of them. So if I sell all that, you know, I can turn these four very fast. You know, probably before I even post this video, those will be sold. And then essentially, um, you know, everything else I hold is profit. Branching evolution. Unless this box is not good, then I'll have to eat into my profits to pay for this one. Alright, Feathered Friends. Okay, we pulled this one already. Let's see if the rare is the same. In the world, I really don't like those inner packs. Angel. No, see? Like, this one is one of the ones that's like $10 or so. And that wasn't in the Feathered Friends before. So... I don't know. I'm not really sure how that works, to be honest. I don't know how the rares are determined here. Smashing. There we go. Okay. Goliath. Sarkin's unsealing. Nothing crazy yet. Minions. Come on, minions. Children. Children. Children's like 10. Ghoul Caller again. Cauldron Eliminate. Yeah, same one as before. Yeah, well, well, well. Okay, there we go. Goblins. Does this one have Maxis? You guys are like, give it up already. You're not going to get that one. He's like 10 bucks. He's 10 bucks. There, see? See, Maxis. I told you. He's like 10 bucks. Makeshift. But also, if you're building a, a goblin deck, you can open a box of this stuff and you know, get a decent amount of goblins to already, you know, start building. So, I'm, I very much like the old Jumpstart stuff. Jumpstart 2020 and 2022. Um, the individual set Jumpstarts, I've never purchased. I never plan to. Okay, Cauldron's in this one, for sure. The cat. The cat. Come on. Bog Brew Witch. Witch. Witch of the Moors. Look at that one. Sacrifice the creature. Okay. Bubbling Cauldron, Tempting Witch, the Black Cat, Wrong Cat, really? Crazy. Tree Huggin, okay, Crater Hook could be here. We want those big, big creatures. Okay, Recluse, Oak, okay. Lanawar, Ambassador Oak, Gnarled Sage. Well, we got roughly 25 in value so far out of those two cards for this box. Um, Roughly. Elves, Allosaurus. Come on, Allosaurus. You're like a 20 bucker. Crater Hoof. Yeah, that's the first. Boom. That's the C in the CPR. C in the C. Oh, Arch Druid. Okay. We don't got an Allosaurus in here, but we got the Arch Druid. 
Gotta have the Crater Hoof in the Elf deck. Okay. C? Are we missing the P? Alt Arch Druid. Visionary. Okay. What the heck? Stuck together? There's another one stuck here, I think. Did you see that? That's the strangest thing I've ever seen. Um, okay, that's garbage. Okay. C, P. So we paid for one box with those two, if you think about it. And trust me, those will sell. It will sell. Oh, more surgery. We got minions again. Oh, there it is. There's the P in the CPR. Holy cow, Cauldron Witch. There we go. Devotee, Crypt Lurker. Nocturnal Feeder, Village Rights. Okay. Okay, okay. So that box, so far, we've hit the C and the P. And um, C and the P pay for the box. So we are doing outstanding CPR. There we are, right there. Outstanding goblins. Give us another Maxis. Or it could be a terror. Maybe they put terror in this one. Krenko. Okay, and we have Krenko in, you know, in 50 million sets, so. Goblin Arsonist. But see what I mean? Like, you can get decent goblin cards. So if you're out there and you're like, hey, what kind of box should I get if I'm just starting magic? This is a great one, right? There's a lot of value in here. It's cheap to get in. You can actually play with the box itself with some friends. And then you can take the cards and pretty much craft the, you know, ha I mean, a playable, half-decent deck, you know, oh my god, this is horrendous. Okay. Okay, the Blessed, uh, he's a couple bucks, I'm just going to set him here because I forget, to be honest. Um, he's, he's very popular in, like, Blink decks, right, because... Milling, milling decks. So we could have a we could have a lot of interesting things on our hands in this one. What could this be? Okay, Bruvac. Yeah. So this is another twelve or so dollar card. Yeah, I forgot he was in there too. Sphinx, Wall, Collapse, Capture Sphere. Yeah, I forgot about him. Tree Huggers again. What was that last time? I already forget. I'm like, I'm not remembering. Soul Harvest. Oh, well, it's different anyway because we haven't pulled those yet. Okay. What do you guys think? You like something different? Okay, we pulled a bunch of plus ones already. Like something different by me going after this uh, jumpstart stuff? Like, what do you, you like to see? Just random things like this, or stick with collectors? Don't. I'm, I'm trying to show that like there's value in, you know, random products. You just have to find it. Um, Wildwood, Truffle Hunters, and it, you know it can be something as strange as this, where it's like if you were gonna go out and. Say, like, you needed a couple of those cards. Is the right thing to go buy the singles off from me? Or is the right... Oh, dinosaurs. I like to see this. There is one dinosaur in here that's, like, 10 bucks. Or So, uh, Primal Hunter. There he is, actually. He's, like, 10 bucks. Um, that's awesome. Cultivate. So, like, you can put... Again, you can put together a pretty great deck with, uh, with doing this. I mean, Cultivate, too, is a single. is a couple, you know, 50 sense a buck and it turns but what I was saying is does it make sense to buy singles in this case 
Like if you need a Ristic Study and a Crater Hoof, or does it make sense to be like, hey, I'll buy a couple boxes of this Jumpstart. Doctors again? Oh, he's another big one in this one. He's like a $15, $18 card. Uh, Light of Promise, Faith's Fetters, Revitalize, Angel, Angel of Mercy. Yeah, we're, we, we, we did great. I mean, we're profitable right here. Um, very much so already. Not including everything that's in our stacks here. Um, again, in this case, you might want to say, hey, oh, cats, come on, the cauldron guy. He's, he's, he's got to be in the cat deck. Oh, no, it ripped on me. I hate this so much. You guys are probably so agitated watching this, uh, this wrapper. You're probably like, I'm out of here. I never want to see this jump start again. Predators. Feline Sovereign. Okay, and Large. Fables. Okay, so this is a green deck. Yeah, there's not going to be in here. Lots of lands, too. So, like, it doesn't look like you have to list as much as you'd think because I'm not going to do much with those lands. Phyrexian. It's going to be Sheldred. Sheldred's a $10. Or maybe it's another Phyrexian Tower. Sheldred, there she, he, she is. Scythe. Reclamation. Myrrh. Ooh. Pretty neat. Hang on to you. I don't know that I've seen the Phyrexian Swamp. I'm going to have to look that one up. Heavily armored. Duelist. Gain double strike. That feels like that's actually pretty good. High Sentinels. Swift. White Walker. Bastry. Okay. Watch that Swamp and Phyrexians like $15. Vampires. Okay, let's see. Veto. Another Veto. Okay, a couple packs left. Can we pull a Terror of the Peaks? Doctors again. We got another get a Rocks, another Rocks coming in? It is another Rocks. Man, another 13 or so bucks. Jeez, awesome. I mean, you pull that every single time, you can't, you can't complain. You can't complain at all. Two packs left to go. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Um, definitely, we, we made we made money today. Holy cow, did we make money today. Uh, this was great. Enchanted. We haven't seen you yet. Hey, Johnny. Okay. Celestial. Okay. Faiths. Like this one. This plane's too. Jumpstart. Like, that's kind of interests me. I don't know. I, I'll probably go through the lands, too, and pull out some fun lands. Last one. What do we got? Tree hugging. Okay, okay. What do we got? Tree hugs. You guys are like, I don't care. I'm out. Overall box, great. Wrapping horrendous. Sage. Okay. Warden. Awesome. Explore. Yeah, that's a jump start land. Okay, and the rest are 2021 lands. Yeah, check that out. So let's just uh, do a little recap here. We got um, you know these two, uh, 13 apiece. Maybe uh, I don't know. Maybe two for him. 10 here, Crusade, let's say is another 12 apiece there, Teferi's 10, we got another 10 here, Bruvax 12, Vito 9, 9, I don't know, 3, 13, 8, I mean, plus CPR, so we did pull 
CPR. When again, when you think jump start, these are the ones of value. This is the these are the top three pulls in the set, and not in this order. It's actually in this order. It's backwards. RP RPC. So, anyhow, thanks for checking it out. Remember, check out my description for all kinds of links and things to reach out, buy stuff, and you know, get connected. Talk to y'all later.